Uh, no, not really. I mean, he's a top player and uh, he's beaten top guys before, played good at big events, gives the best players a hard time and beats them sometimes. So, um, you know, so you got to expect uh, him to come out there and um, play a tough match. I remember watching him here also, maybe against Sasha and somebody else as well. I thought I was very impressed how, you know, how easy he's able to stay in the rallies on the on the grass court and uh, He's got a very dangerous forehand, as we saw, with his sort of more open continental grip. It allows him to really hit through the court and, uh, you know, he puts on the back foot. And if you're not careful and you don't have enough firepower, you know, he'll dictate uh, the baseline rallies and uh, he can do that. Not a problem, you know, so I'm, uh, no, I'm not surprised and um, I, enjoyed, I enjoyed the battle. Again, so like she's not winning anything or... She's uh, doing okay. <laughs> so the question is that she lost again. <laughs> um, uh, you cannot play well every week. You know, it's that simple. Uh, or win every week. Nobody does that, basically. So, uh, you know, uh, she's got a head start with her back-to-back -back Grand Slam wins and, uh, you know, once she's done it, she, she knows she can do it again and uh, it was the same for me. You know, after I won Wimbledon, I also didn't win right away everything after that, you know, so, and you got to take the losses and just uh, shake them off and don't let the press bother you with silly questions and uh, you just go go on with it, you know, what else can you do? Then go back to the practice courts, and try to, you know, work on your game and, uh, you know, from having nothing to lose, everybody now feels like it's an amazing win to beat you, but for you nothing changed other than that you have, you know, a couple of Grand Slams and you're world number one. So it's obviously a massive change, but uh, at the end of the day, you're still the same person and um, you try your very best every single day. And uh, we saw again today in this match, you know, Things are so close sometimes, and there's not even a need to explain why you lost. You know, it just it just happens sometimes. Dann bitte Deutsch, Stefan.